What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. I am Ken or Kendra, whichever one you prefer to call me. Um, if you haven't already subscribed, hit the subscribe button and follow your girl. Keep up with me. Hit the bell so that you be notified whenever I upload. And yeah, follow me on Instagram at underscore underscore I am Ken underscore. I think that's my Instagram name, but I'm gonna have it on the screen somewhere. Um, so yeah, now we got that out the way. Y'all, it's been one heck of a few weeks. I actually vlogged last week, but um, I'm not going to post it because that vlog, I felt like this was all over the place when I had to start to go edit it. I'm just like, this is just not, it just was all over the place. Yes, ma'am. You cannot have another one. No, ma'am. Not right now. Sit down for me, please. Now, um, that vlog was just all over the place, and as I was watching some of the clips, I just was like, this don't, this is gonna make sense. It's on the charger here, but you got to sit up and use it. Okay, sit back so she can sit up, so your phone charge. Um, yeah, I'm like, this just, it just, it just didn't, it didn't have no flow, so I just chose, no, just sit right here. Sit, Kai, can you scoot to the door real quick? Huh? Can you scoot to the door so she can get on her phone? Y'all get back in the I don't care. Well, what's up with y'all with this middle C? Y'all is weird. We used to argue about sitting in the in the in the by the door. <laughs> Give me a phone, girl. They be arguing about who gonna get the middle seat. Sit back in the Do y'all remember y'all little y'all? I I know it couldn't have just been us. We used to argue about who gonna get the dough seat. Who gonna sit by the window? Um. But anyway. Yeah, the, the vlog just didn't have no flow, but basically the vlog was just, um, I was vlogging us moving, packing up our stuff very abruptly and quickly, unexpected, and moving back to Huntsville, Alabama. So, yes, that's where I'm at now. I'm in Huntsville, Alabama right now. We packed up our stuff the last time we came down here. We came down here. Did I vlog that? I'm not even sure if I vlogged that, but... If I did, it would be the, the vlog before Halloween. But if I didn't, yeah, we came down here. We came up here. Um. I'm not the same No, we came down here. Right. We came here. Um. I'm I'm kind of kind of slow. G give me a second. Get my thoughts together. Turn it down. You don't make me lose. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We came here, um, like, I want to say three weeks ago for a few days. And then during the time here before we had left and went back to, um, before we had left and went back that last day, we had just decided that we was going to move back here for plenty of reasons. And I think I'm going to make a separate video a chit chat video or something to you know just talk to y'all update y'all about where i'm at in my life and my spiritual journey and self-love journey and then my journey said just never ending it's a continuous thing because we are we are human and we are all, always evolving we never not evolving if you're not evolving girl that means you're stagnant you need to get up and do something with your life but we're always evolving whether we want to or not and i've Feel like that those journeys it's like a never-ending journey but um yeah i make a chit chat video about the reasons some of the reasons for the move and and whatnot but we've been back here since we came back last week on friday morning we made it we made it here today is wednesday the day before thanksgiving so the goal was to get him before Thanksgiving and we we made it here last weekend on Friday morning so we just literally packed up our clothes and our necessities and came on here so yeah y'all life life is just crazy and it, it can be crazy sometimes and it's real real unexpected like we literally live life walking by faith anyway so I feel like if we already is forced to wake up and not know how your day gonna be like not knowing how your day gonna play out you might as well put your faith in the right thing put your faith in god and just do it um the right way opposed to doing it out of fear and doing it out of stress and worry and um um being uncomfortable i just believe that it just 
and you make it easier by just taking that faith that you are already putting into other things that's negative and putting it to God so that you can get the best out of your day and out of your life and whatnot. But yeah, life 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 is very unexpected and throws very unexpected curveballs and just can be really hectic at times. But it is what it is. So yeah, that's what we at. We here. But right now I'm at Cabana, Cabana, Cabana Wax. This place for my sister. Just to get the kids the kids out the house because they've been in the house since we moved back last week Friday. Um Yeah, just get them a little breather, a little break away from the house because I think children need that time too to get a breather and get away. Um because my kids my kids have been in Chicago since February. <laughs> my kids have been in Chicago since February and so they have started to become very accustomed to just being around me and their dad and our way of, you know, our new way of raising them and teaching them. Um, I'm trying to create uh, I'm not trying nothing. I am creating. I have created um, different rules and boundaries and um, to live by. And one of those, one of those, a segment, of, a segment of that, of those rules and boundaries and beliefs is um, on how I raise my children um, and bringing them back here where they're around my parents 24 7 because we are living with my parents at the moment until we find us a place but being around them every single day and we're living with them now they have their own way of doing stuff and I just don't want it to I, I'm trying to make a transition from being in Chicago then finally becoming accustomed to being in Chicago um, and then just abruptly moving them back here. I'm trying to make it as smooth as possible because I, I, that it was a lot for me, and so I know it can be very confusing and um, hard for a child to cope with and you know transition into. So I just decided to. My sister was like, "You want to get up to get the kids at the house and grab me while I go get to go get my wax?" I'm like, "Sure, why not?" So that's what we had. We sit in the car. While she's inside getting her wax, not doing much, but just to get them out of the four walls of the house. So yeah, I'm vlogging today, and I I just be trying to get people their space, cause y'all, it's so many of us living in the house. Like if I can keep it real, keep it honest. Can you speak? Keep it a hundred with y'all. It's a lot of us in that in that little house, and I'm grateful that we got a roof over our head. It's just a lot of us and a lot of attitudes and personalities and um, I just be want to. I'm I'm trying to continue to do what I'm doing for my you know when it comes to my YouTube channel and vlogging and stuff and creating videos, but still respecting folks' privacy and their you know their space. So I get it in while I can, fit it in while I can um, here and there. But yeah, that's what's going on. That's what's happening. I think I'm going film the chit chat little uh, up uh, I ain't gonna say get ready with me but I am gonna probably make up my face and do like a little content day to take pictures and stuff but um I'll probably film, film that Friday after Thanksgiving so today is Wednesday Thanksgiving is tomorrow so I'll probably film that Friday it's and get that to y'all. Just give y'all an update on what's going on. You see that bubble face? Um, yeah. yeah. Let's and how I'm dealing with things. Maybe it can motivate you guys on learning, you know, different ways of how to cope with stuff and deal with stuff. And I don't know. That's the plan. That's what's going on. So, yeah. I'll talk to y'all when... I oh, don't know. Some sometime today I'll talk to y'all. I know everybody gonna have on clothes today because we cleaning the house and prepping Thanksgiving food. My mama probably making pies right now, but he ate it and he let him make up. Look, huh? What's the Grinch say? It come back. Look. Hello. Well, hello, my friend. How are you? You need to sound those words out and read them yourself. I'll talk to y'all when we get back to the house. 
or wherever we go. I don't know. And y'all will see. All right, we're making a pit stop. My sister came out of the, from getting her wax. Woo, it's fun. Kyrie, now you went to up down, but it's okay. Oh yeah, y'all face Ash. Let me put some lotion in their face real quick. Nuh-uh, I got it. Please. Can I never hold the camera? You don't need to hold it. Huh? You don't need to hold it. I want to hold it. Hold it. Hey, guys. It's me, Ken. Wait, wait, they your face ass, Tark. You just gonna say that? Yeah, your face ass, you too. All right, ma'am. Ain't getting in the lab out? I know y'all see my... I know y'all see my... Your face is ash. I know y'all see my gaming videos. Please. I need a million likes. Ken, you don't have no gaming videos yet, son. You see me promote. I am going to make you a channel, but dang. This boy promote before he can even get the channel. I want to be like my son. Come on, check this out. Come here, Ken. I over here. Come here. Come here. Give me a chicken sandwich and see. Can be walking up Ash. Onion rings. Girl, go take a set of onion rings. Pat Pat so smelling good right now. Pat Pat smelling good. Oh, delicious. Pat <laughs> Pat smells real good. I mean, so. I'm getting it. Pat Pat's even got it. Yeah, I'm trying to get it. Rub in, I'm gonna put it on your head. Kayla can do tire hair while you doing everybody else, huh? Yeah. Nicolette ain't getting no color. Sorry, home girl. I know you watching videos. If you ain't getting no color to die. Kenya, where are you? You get color. Um, she can get some color maybe. Kaya, don't go that this way. This weekend. Way. But not today. <laughs> not the day before Thanksgiving. Alright, come on. Oh, yeah, she is gonna be in. Um, Oh, come on, come on, y'all. Come Kai. Come over here, Kenya. So we out getting ice cream. Get the kids some ice cream. It's at this place the ice come to. Out of ten, and Kyrie just told me that they were just bought out by a uh, black, by black people for their black own. Now, don't trust the camera in my hand. I know. No. So. Zippy jacket of sun. Bubble gum. They have the. Um, I don't think I. Oh, they have pistachio chocolate. They got nerds, caramel cone crunch, chocolate brownie trump. I mean, no, them hurricanes. Them like they blizzards, okay, like they. They got strawberry cheesecake chunk, Janaya. They got. Um, they got cotton candy. I don't. Which cone you want? You want the cake cone or you want the sugar? Cone? Nah, you want this. Which cone? This one or this one? I want that cake cone. This cake cone? This the cake cone. I want, I want the, This the sugar cone. I want the that big one. one. Y'all want this, this too big for y'all. This is... Which one of these two? These y'all only two options. I want the... Uh, the sugar cone. I want, I want the cup one. This one? You're not getting this one. You, you only can choose between these two. Um, chocolate chip cookie dough. Mm. Yeah. Look good too. That's mine? Mm-hmm. 
You gonna drop it? Uh, wait till mm -hmm. we get in the car. I don't need trust it. Let me taste it. She says it's a really sticky ice cream. That look fun. <laughs> do. Mm. Mm. Tell like a birthday cake. You do? Mm -hmm. Wait, I'm gonna hold it. I want to taste it. Um, crazy lady, but she got the pass going. Pass, okay, okay, dear. Okay, Stormy. Stormy. <laughs> Y'all being so ghetto. <clears throat> One. Let me stop walking so fast. I am out of breath. But I'm walking, taking me a little walk. It is dark outside, as y'all can see, and I'm using my camera flash. Um, walking straight, I'm using my camera flash so y'all can see me. But <sighs> I just need to get out the house. It's hard living with a lot of people, especially when, if I can be honest. Especially when um, you're married. And the marriage is hard. Hard as hell. If I can be honest. I need to. I don't know. I think I'm going to. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I need God to really, like, give me some type of instruction on what I need to do. I'm turning around so my daddy won't come looking for me or my husband. But what I need to do, because I feel like something ain't right. And this crap is hard. I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm not going for my move. It's hard. And living with other people ain't making it any don't make it no better <sighs> i'm just trying to remain faithful and this is a part of the spiritual journey that becomes a little bit difficult well that can be difficult if you make it difficult just having faith even when you don't even like you feel like you don't even have the strength or you don't even know how <sighs> especially when you don't know what to do in a certain situation the only thing that I know how to do is is to don't stop don't stop keep going keep doing and while I'm doing it, I might as well have faith in God. Opposed to me having faith in fear and doubt and pain and stress. You, you, your faith will get put somewhere, whether you like it or not. I think I told y'all this earlier. So you might as well go ahead and... Put your faith, I'm out of breath, y'all. Put your faith in the truth. A God that is so faithful, cannot lie, never leaves you. So yeah, if I had to encourage anybody, same thing to encourage anybody today, or no. If I had the same thing to encourage anybody today while encouraging myself is to in the midst of adversity in the midst of um in the midst of going through and feeling like <sighs> feeling like you want to give up feeling like you don't know 
whether you should go right or left, up or down. Um, when you don't know where the bill money gonna come from, when you don't know how you gonna eat, or you don't know how you gonna get to work because you ain't got no gas money to put gas in your car, keep going. Keep going. Wake up every morning with the knowing that God gonna make a way. We need these times in our life to help build us, strengthen us, so that we can be prepared and we can pass a test to be able to move to the next level in life. <sighs> so yeah, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. It wasn't really much. I'm not doing nothing. I'm just showing y'all my life and it's not much. No, it's a lot to show because I am a lot. But um, yeah, just my journey on where I'm at now and me and 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 me in preparation to get to where I know I'm gonna get to and taking y'all along the journey. So yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click that bell so that you be notified every time I make a new upload. And yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Come on, Thursday. Thursday. You be out oh, you really can't get to check on me. I'll try to play it off. But yeah, see y'all later.